Good morning. It is time again for us to check in. Check in with God and to check in with each other. So please, those of you who have cell phones or tablets, take a moment now and email, text, tweet, Facebook, three people and let them know that you're praying for them this morning from the park. Gives us a chance to let others know we're here and to remind us that our prayers don't remain just inside these walls. And as we're doing that, let us join together in prayer. Ever-present and ever-loving God, we pause this morning to thank you for this time we have together, this time to catch up with each other, this time to renew our connection, not only with each other, but also with you. We are thankful for this opportunity to be renewed and refreshed after the stresses of the week and to prepare ourselves for the week to come. We also pause in prayer for others, for our neighbors. We pray for Nepal, hit with another earthquake this week, as they set up relief areas and work to recover from the loss of loved ones and shelter. Help them to feel your presence with them. Help them as well as their neighbors around the world helping them in their efforts to rebuild their lives, their homes, and their families. We also pray, God, for those affected by the Amtrak accident this week and the lives lost there as well. We pray for the comfort, we pray for comfort for their family and friends and the recovery of those injured. May we seek justice in this accident, not to punish, but to learn what happened and how to pre prevent future accidents on our transportation systems. And God, we ask for a little bit of your understanding towards each other. So often we seek to alienate those who are not like us, whether it be due to religion, skin color, sexual or gender orientation, class, customs, intellectual level, and so many other things. We see this so often in places like Boston, Israel, and Palestine, Indiana, and even right here in our own backyard. Help us remember that you created us all in your image, and we are all blessed by you. And finally, God, we ask for your prayers for our neighbors, our friends and family here in the church that need a little extra healing, a little extra love from you. We ask for all of those named, in, named by us and unknown only to you. We remember in prayer this week McNeil Robinson, Worley McReynolds, Mildred Lee, Belle Taylor, Justin Strickland, Eddie Schiller, Francisca Torres, Mary Virginia Moore, Josiah Waters, Jamie Arkellian, Dorothy McCarthy, Mark Leach, Alan Walker, Terry Jones, Reverend John Wade Payne, Joy Masfell, and the family of Al McCready. May everyone know your presence and your healing with them. We ask all of this in Jesus' name. Amen. <laughs> 